Does anyone else think Arrakis belongs to the Fremen? We've got ourselves a Fremen game here. Just a casual one with some buddies. We're gonna see what we can do here. Good luck, have fun, everybody. May thy knives chip and shatter. Indeed. Indeed. Let's do a couple trades. Let's get some trades going. We've got uh, we've got that Stilgar giving us those early sieges. What does Liet command? We won't waste time. Let's go get our... You know, we'd... It, w it was pointed out to me that you don't really need to take that first village for the spice field. You don't need to take spice fields at all. Maybe there's other things we should take instead of that. Maybe we'll maybe we'll play it cool. Maybe there'll be something better up here. I'm just so used to just running right in. Oh, minerals. Deal. We'll start right on the minerals instead of on the spice field. Oh, but we forgot to make a harvesting team. <laughs> Off to a bad start. Redo. Redo. Restart it, boys. I forgot to make my spice team for three days. We'll, we'll make do, I guess. We'll manage some way or another. What do we got today? What do we got? Uh, we got uh, Stilgar and Mother Omalo, my chosen pair of counselors. I think they're by far the best. Um, the other ones I know people have been playing with and trying to get them to work. Shamoom is fine, the water lady. Um, who's the other one? Jamis? Jamis is fine. He's, a, he's more of a sort of an aggro kind of dude. Gives you the extra authority back for pillage and stuff. No problem with that, he's a good dude, but uh, I feel like Mother Romalo is really good now that they gave her also authority generation. And Stilgar just letting you see all of the sieges on the map at once is just awesome. It's just awesome. It's so, so good. I can't, can't recommend it enough. I think we'll invest in a rather early skirmisher to help out here. And let's go. Let's go. Get some tech. Let's get some techs. This is only a two wind, that's lousy. There's a three wind, oh my god, look at this wind. Two, 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 three, three. We don't even have um, that lousy wind tech for the Fremen, because we've got our, we're just gonna have to make do with really, really horrible wind regions. What's the lousy wind tech called? Insulated valleys, that's what I'm thinking. Makes pay, like Gives you some, some cheaper upkeep and, and discounted costs on regions that only have two wind in them. But we don't have that. We're the Fremen. We just gotta deal with what we got here. What does Liet command? Ooh, okay, okay. Let's keep keep looking, keep checking out their harvesters. Ooh, we do got a close by ruins. We love those for the Fremen. They're especially good because they pay out extra authority to the Fremen and not yes. to anyone else. So that's good deal, good deal. We've got some rare minerals over there. We don't see any special regions around us yet. The desert will surprise you. What are we going to take? Probably our rare minerals is number two up on the, uh, the to-do list here, I think. Let's make sure we refill our supplies. We were running razor-thin margins since, um, since we're, we're trading with those early sieges. Razor thin margins. Three economy building, 30 agent recruitment speed on this first village. That uh, is not too exciting. Not too exciting at all. But this one is much better. 20% and 20% and it's a rare element. So we will get all the percents. Extra 40% on that once we get it up and running. Don't mind that at all. Not at all. <clears throat> Who else we got with us today? We got Koof on the House Vernius. We've got Conrad on the Smugglers, and Hybrids Unite on House Atreides. The desert will surprise you. We'll see what we can do today. We'll see what we'll see what they can do. We'll see what everybody can do. Looks like maybe our advan our siege our siege scouting down there is poking out Atreides, probably in the south, sort of southeast-ish. So they're not a neighbor of ours. That's fine, we don't really want to fight Atreides, they're pretty annoying to fight these days. Atreides, the, the beneficiaries of the last, uh, of the big Heroes of Doom patch, the beneficiaries of just a number of relatively small tweaks here and there that just seem to have added up to make them pretty just generalist strong across the board. 
strong army, strong economy, strong politics. Like they can, they can get a lot of stuff done. They still tend to be a tad on the passive side, though. You you don't have to play them that way. I I rather like an aggressive Atreides myself, but they can do the big old hedge boom as good or better than most, thanks to some shenanigans with the old peaceful annexes. But uh, we're not going to worry about that too much today. We've got other things on our mind. We are taming the desert today. We'll get our processing plant up over here. This guy, I don't know, I'll just keep throwing yellow stuff in there. Is it worth building a wind trap in a place with two wind? We would get four water out of it for eight upkeep. You know, I guess it's not the end of the world. We're actually going to stick a maintenance center there first, and then maybe we'll build... We might as well just build wind traps everywhere. We do have another spice field down there, so we want a harvesting caravan, which we can get pretty quickly here. We're going to up our rate to make sure we're selling a little more at the 2.0 rate, which is a decent enough. Uh, 2.0 is st statistically average for spice sales, but having a little extra to work with in the early game is very useful. He who beats you in digging, beat him in pruning. And where do we want to go? There's more rare elements over. There's more rare elements above us, and a space wreck. Who, mama? We love a space wreck. Fremen, of course, start with zero spaceship parts, um, while everyone else starts with like 40. So it's a pain in the butt to get enough parts for your spaceship. But uh, of course, that's a lot easier if you've got uh, the spaceship wreck giving you an extra part per day. Really, uh, really simplifies the whole process quite a bit there. Got some raiders, but that's okay. I know, I know they're friends. They just don't know that they're friends yet. We are unfortunately on zero water. Just gonna make expansion slightly challenging for us. I think maybe we invest in another military unit to speed up our battles. And we've got some lands red. We are not doing any rebellions, since so we're not gonna waste that precious authority early in the game. And we don't really have enough to contest anything either, so we'll just let it let it slide. We don't care. What do we want? Do we want another skirmisher? They're not the best DPS early. We could do an infiltrator maybe to help chop up ranged guys. Yeah, we could do that. I could live with that. So we're getting our Fremen Solidarity up for a little extra recruitment speed. We're going to get probably Dialect Studies and then Desert Wisdom. And by then, we kind of want our wind traps up all over anywhere we can. We need some of that water. What are these guys? So, 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 so we've got maxed out authority with a bunch of places, but we don't really need any Siege Alliances early on. Siege Alliances, of course, cost a tad bit of authority and a tad bit of, um, is it water? Yeah, four water, 0.5 authority. Um, and you hate to give away authority early on when you want to be expanding. I may actually stop being friends with one of these guys. <laughs> let's, 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 woo, do, 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 Plascrete, maybe, okay. We'll stop trading for Plascrete because we've got a ton of Plascrete currently and we need some we need some water to be able to get out and about and do things. We must go okay, top up your supplies, and we're going to go grab stuff. Life is in the this guy is harvesting the spice life. down there. Good, good. we got a well of riches w to the west, and what looks like smuggler thopters over there, which leaves purple vernius to the east. Ooh, eyeballed another, another spice up there. Yes. Don't mind if we do. I think... I think we're gonna go up, we'll grab this other rare elements up there. We'll just lean into the, the banging element economy. Should be all good. We're gonna build a research station there, which normally we wouldn't. But we're gonna do it just because um, we need we need a blue there, and it'll be it'll be nominally useful for us in the early game here. Up until, up until uh, we get our water online, where, we, where, where we're getting paid out from the uh, the desert wisdom, paying us out knowledge for all of our wind traps, is what I'm trying to say. This guy goes walk up there to that. We got another spice down there. Maybe we do another. Yeah, maybe we just spice our brains out. We just go nuts with the spice. 
Okay, so what are we picking? I think we're picking Desert Wisdom. We got a lot of land we want. We might do some native customs into outpost logistics. Is that too greedy? That is too greedy, so let's do it. Because we like the greed. Oh, we want a bazaar up maybe earlier. Maybe we go Sand Brotherhood and then onward. I can live with that. Processing plant. This place is three wind, of course. Terrible wind everywhere we go. What should we grab next? Not a lot around us that's too exciting right now. We might as well grab this space wreck. We might as well get heart spice team number four out and about. We might have to race Vernius to it, and Vernius might be trying to get that. No matter how much you eat, you tell you what, let's fast. we're gonna undeploy our, our harvester at our base. We're gonna get them a little bit more supply and then have them walk out and grab that spice that Vernius wants. See if we can race their uh, their harvester guy out to it. If their if their harvesting drone gets there before us, um, we can't use it. We are so keep an eye on those Fremen, lad. We're invisible. <laughs> I do love the invisible Fremen playstyle. They usually get up to some funny business. Conrad's an old veteran. I've played with Conrad many a time. I think. Koof is a bit newer. Hybrids Unite I do not know well. He recognized me, which is never a good sign. I prefer to be anonymous, but that's not working so well for me these days. <laughs> what do we grab? We'll make sure we got a lot of good points of interest around us. We've got to grab... This place has three wind. Oh boy. It's the best wind we've got. Three wind. The desert will surprise you. We make grab some mouse. points of interest, shall we? we will help if we and I think next we walk over and probably grab that spot. We in fact, listening. everybody, they just go grab that spot here. first. Taking position. We'll take we can go grab points of interest later when we're a little more bored. So far looking good, feeling good. This guy over here probably needs some wind. That guy's built out. This guy needs stuff. Gotta make sure we're building. Make sure no one's dying to militia. We should be okay. Get some wind. Get some water up everywhere we can. What do you need? We're gonna we're gonna be on one, two. We're gonna be on three rare elements regions. Maybe we could push real hard for those for that well of riches to the west. There's one in the middle too. There's rare elements everywhere. We could be on like a zero spice economy and just be living our best life out here. <clears throat> free Fidaken that we got from the quest, but we're not going to turn it in. And we're not going to turn it in because we've got 28 days to turn it in, and because Fidekin take like 20 Solaria a day to upkeep, which is a lot. We did get out here and snab that, nab that spice field. I wouldn't be surprised if Vernius was displeased with us about that, but what are they going to do? I'm pretty sure, pretty, pretty sure that Fremen, um, with any sort of preparation at all, Beat the hell out of uh, early Vernius aggression. <laughs> Be fair, from beat the hell out of just about everybody pretty we early on. So we're here. I think we're, we're gonna pillage that. We're ready to Let's do some pillaging the with our with the old the old squad. This guy wants one of each up here, so. Good spot for manpower, which we already kind of wanted. This guy pays out extra plazcrete, but is that worthwhile? I guess I'm not likely to have any other sources of plazcrete in the short term, so we'll do that because we're going to start building out our main base. And we've got Landsrad. Um, we're only at 79 influence, which is basically nothing. <clears throat> we'll let it all go. We don't care. Keep on banking. And we're good with water, so we're going to get back out there and find some sieges to be buddies with. Buddies with you, buddies with you, buddies with you, and with you. And, dare I? And with you. <laughs> we'll trade with all the sieges. And so what we need is our sand brotherhood so we can build the bazaar building, which will go up next. And we're gonna need some 
some water sooner rather than later since we just gave it all away. Listen to the sound. We'll look for invaders there. But yeah, I do kind of like the idea of just not even bothering to annex your spice fields and just pillaging them. I think that'll work out just fine for us. In the short term, at least. What does command? I'm liking our map. It looks like we've got a lot of space. A lot of space to spread out. Grab good stuff. Which is all you really want when you are uh, a nice, aggressive as expander like the Fremen. Yeah, I think we're going to do a little bit of a pillaging tour. As best we can with one water, <laughs> which is not very good, but we could do a little bit. We can sneak around, hug the borders to refill our water back at home. And uh, we will definitely look for a bazaar up next. So what we're going to do in our main base is we're going we're gonna to open with an administrative hall to, for that extra authority production. We're going to follow up with a bazaar to max out our trades, and it also will count as an economy building, so we will get that... that tier 2 economy of 30 solari production which is not a good <laughs> not a good thing to have it's not particularly beneficial 30 is pretty small but um, it's something and then later in the game we'll end up switching that administrative hall out for a, a red building in order to get the double red bonus in the main base that is the plan make sure we are building good stuff why can't oh can't build stuff because of water. That's all right. Stick the old wholesale market in then. When in doubt, you can always market. Listening. Oh, did someone must have walked in and killed my harvester Reed. there? Did they do that with an assassin? I didn't s even Reed. see myself getting attacked Willing. unless I was just. I don't know. Definitely lost Reed a harvester there. Hmm. The Vernius is to blame. Vernius uh, and the smugglers took what we wanted over there. We hates them, precious. We hates those dirty smugglers. Smugglers also tend to struggle a bit with the uh, the old Fremen military, so we will probably pay them a visit sooner rather than later. But for the moment, we're a tad light on manpower, which is what we want more of. Get some recruitment offices up. We got the, thanks to all of our rare elements, we could certainly afford it. And we do got enough, uh, we do got enough, um, bum, 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 hegemony to make our space, our space base. So I think we will do that. Hybrids Unite is disconnected. Oh, no. Give him a little pause, wait for him. I think he's, I think he's a Discord lad. We could see if we could ping him. Hybrids. Yeah, hybrid, you okay, buddy? Hmm, you hate to lose someone this early in the game. It would really ruin the whole game. Hmm. <sighs> All right, just waiting. Waiting to see what Buddy Hybrids has in store for us. I think maybe we can now do the, the little walk around we had planned to grab all of these goodies across the map. Good, good. Hybrid tells us he's got network error issues, first time ever. <coughs> Give him a second, see if you can reconnect.
is our home. We'll hide our tracks. On the lookout. Listen to the sound. What does Liet command? Lead us to freedom. Listening. With Shai Hulud's favor. And I've been talking on mute for some time. Who knows how long? <laughs> I don't know, I must, maybe I muted myself uh, while I was coughing during during that uh, disconnect for the guy. But I've been chatting up a storm. You liar! He says prim and aggression already. You steal my land and slander me. Keep your wits about you, he says. Well, now we are gonna fight you. If you're already, if you're already complaining about it, it's no need for me to go light. We're Let's listening. get our folks out and about. Yes. We got a ton of thopters. Or I thought we did. Did they, we must have lost a bunch of them to the storm there, huh? Cycling plant up. Pretty please. Warriors over there. Pretty please. And then we will go fight the smugglers. I ain't afraid of no smugglers. Minus damage received from range attacks. Yes. Yes, son. That sounds good to me. We're going through the armory. We're not going to incite any rebellions, but we do have enough votes to put our fingers on the scale somewhere if we want. We've got an all factions gain on everything, so we'll just leave it alone for now. We'll go back to our armory. We want our infiltrators to be invisible and we want our fedekins to um, chop up more enemies in AOE Please. and we are gonna go take this from Please him because he's building missile turrets building missile turrets is aggression We stealth our guys. We will prep some good stuff. This is the defensive structure. You've scared me into this. He went with the four heavy militia we there, actually. It might be a bit Taking challenging. Belongs to the we'll avoid he says, the I sun. just wanted to make water unacceptable. You forced my hand. I think we got a decent enough little early game force here. I'm not too afraid of some snipers. We'll buff up our supplies. We are getting attacked by Vernia's drones. That's pretty annoying. It's pretty annoying, Vernius. Are you well? 
holes do not cause harm. That must have been how they got me out of my other guy. They're sending railgun drones to attack my harvesters. I can't believe this. We're just just correcting historical borders. We trust you, Liet. We are listening. We'll claim their water. Let's get this uh, infiltrator up on his guy. Calling on the great houses. <laughs> Never heard of him. If we get our little infiltrator up on this guy soon enough, he will wreck him. That would be nice. I'm gonna keep an eye, make sure those sneaky smugglers aren't out and about causing us trouble. Oh my god, we're down to... we're low on harvesters. People are out and about assassinating my harvesters. Oh, and he is, of course, the smuggler guy that is, um, plus five million percent, uh, s s siege time. So we could be sitting here all the live long day. Could be here forever waiting for this. But we're dedicated to it. Let's make it happen. We just gotta keep an eye on them, make sure we don't get uh, ambushed here. The sneaky, s sneaky snipers popping out of stealth to shoot us. <clears throat> we do hate that Vernius guy a lot. We're gonna go mess with him if we ever get the opportunity. This guy over here is getting some good stuff. Some more water is always good. Liet, our Chris knives are unsheathed. Hmm. That Vernia. I don't know. I really didn't like that Vernia's mech sneaking around. He's next on our on our list. We are stockpiling good. We probably should have been paying more attention to that, but it's going okay. We are actually well manpowered, so we need to get uh, some defenses up before more random drones wander in and give me heartburn. Listen to the sound. And we are getting close to <laughs> towards finally finishing this annex. Another four or five months, and we should be right there. <laughs> we can make more guys, too. But we just spent all of our manpower on... We just spent all of our manpower on the uh, militia, which was probably a tad on the foolish. But I don't think that Conrad wants any of this. <clears throat> if I were him, I'd give it a try. But, um... He certainly doesn't need to. I'm sure he can afford to let it go. And a fight with a Fremen is never a fun one. What's this? The railgun drone again. I hate them. I hate these drones. Koof. This is war, you know. This is war, Koof. About to make me friends with smugglers. Oh, beautiful five wind strength. You love to see it. Could I surround this deep desert? I probably could. It's a lot of regions. Oh my goodness, don't get eaten by a worm, guys. Oh, it's a little dicey. It's a little dicey. I think we'll be okay. <coughs> Excuse me. No, you know, that's not the spot for maintenance. Manpower, if you had one building of each type, that's, we could do that. We are, no we're fortunately that we don't even need spice to be able to do all kinds we're of wonderful things. <laughs> we just gotta make sure that we pay our taxes with it. We're getting so much money from, uh, so much money from, you know, there he is again, this guy. 
I'm gonna just walk over and murder him. He's like a he's an existential threat to me. What do you need? Where are Rockus claws? Are you well? Lead us to freedom. What can we go? Let's go burn down that spice Rockus field, shall we? If he wants to if he wants the bull, give him the horns. We are just about maxed out on influence. What do we want? What do we want? Um, cheaper Solari? Could we beat anyone on that? No, Atreides could still muster up. Everybody could get 250, so we can't really force anything through. We'll let it go. We'll keep stockpiling. Oh, it was, we, we should have paid attention. It was economic developments. Tech was, was patched up that time around. How can I help? Do you want to be friends, Smuggles? I'm willing to accept friendship. He's, he accepted. I sort of did not expect him to do that. <laughs> but we'll take it. We trust you, Liet. Swift as the wind. We'll follow the path you set before us. What would be... A good siege to ally with if I wanted to do that. Probably the four knowledge siege would be a good one. Cheaper recruitment time. We love that. We don't need it right now, but we love it. Belongs to the Fremen. We need to prep ourselves a supply drop, and then we're going to go take their spice field from them because they are jerks. And we've got our sneaky we stabbers ready to catch this railgun out here. The infiltrator gone? should tear a railgun apart. Indeed it does. Indeed it does. We're here. We are listening. We'll move fast. We're a raucous clause. You can only play this tune so many times before I get wise, my man. Furthermore, your railguns are fairly expensive. Lead us to freedom. Let's get some Fedakin up. Some Fedakin. <clears throat> we'll wait for the Fedakin and Let then we will uh, out and about. Do infiltrators not lose supplies when they're out away from home? Because mine are not. Which is kind of amazing. With favor. Kind of amazing. What do you need? Is that intended? It can't possibly be. Is that a bug? I don't know. I certainly have never noticed it before. Don't smugs. <laughs> don't do it. This is just pillaging. Just we pillaging. Trust you, yeah, me too. Just pillaging. Come on, Fedakin. Fedakin. You know. Fedakin is like the default, like Fedakin is what I want to say, but Fedakin is where my brain starts at, so it doesn't know we get all the way to where I want it to be. <laughs> Alright, we will, we are going to stealth up and we are going to run over and take the worm nest from this fella here. We're going to come back and we're going to keep grabbing the red techs. We trust you. Everybody get by the village. We need to top off supplies. We, are listening. we don't have quite enough yet for Chani, so we'll go without her. We'll avoid the sun. All right, everybody gets a stealth. And everybody start walking. He'll never see us coming. Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. No matter how much you eat. Okay, we are harvesting, feeling pretty good about it. With Shyalud's favor, listening. Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. They do have a missile turret up here. will avoid the sun. But not an airbase, but yes, a military base. Doesn't matter to me. We are gonna wreck you guys. 
drop some supplies, we'll drop some scav teams, we'll prep more supplies, more hidden tracks, more scav teams. And we will start the annexing. Um, I would be stunned if Vernius was able to do anything about this at this early stage. I feel like a 55 strength army is gonna burn him to the ground if they tried to contest me. You certainly can't send Suboids against the Fremen. The only really option is to poke at stuff elsewhere. Which I don't think he can do in the current timeline. Let's check around, see if there's any other 10% more Solari production. We could do that. I'll take that. And we got ourselves a nice little footprint here. One special, two special, three special. We'll be on like three special, which ain't too bad. And more if we push towards the mid. We're pretty far out from the mid. We're, in, we're nestled kind of, kind of far back. But we're going to keep uh, punishing Vernius, I think, because he started it. And why Why wouldn't I? I why am I out of Thopters? Have my Thopters been getting hunted down by people? Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. I don't Fantastic understand. Statecrafts are slower. Command points are more expensive. Yeah, it hardly matters. We've got, we're making so much money from all of our rare elements that it's like, who cares? There's Vernius. There he is. Liet? We trust you, Liet. We might just go jump right on top of him and just keep going. Listening. Is there any reason to annex that? Probably not. We might just liberate it. We will just peel up, destroyed. supply up. Get our harvester over here. Get our wind traps up. We trust you. Where's our extra guys? Get our extra guys moved up. It's a long walk, but they can do it. And once our extra guys walk over, we'll go, we'll go mess them up. And Chani can come too. Yes, please. I love Chani. She's so fun. Space cruiser scraps. Everything's looking good. We're getting most of what we want. The smugglers are leaving us alone. Let's check Pichome real quick. We are not doing anything there. 6%, 4%. The elected faction gains. We don't care about Lanzarad standing. We would like stuff to be cheaper. Hmm. But we would have to fight a tradey. We would, yeah, we can't beat anyone for it. We'll let it go. We'll just sit on our influence. Yep, we would have lost it. Life choo, choo, choo. Any points of interest life. we need to be grabbing? Can I keep an eye on that? Okay, we're grabbing that one. That's Are fine. Well? We got a we'll new harvester caravan to do some harvesting. He is all spread out back here. Interesting. What's my tech looking like? Desert Trekkers is up and it is nighttime. What do you need? So finally getting some more Thopters up. I wonder what happened to all my Thopters? Were they, were they get just getting shot by people? Who would do such a thing? What kind of a monster shoots a Thopter? Conrad disconnected. Hi, yay, yay. The disconnects this game. Uh, Conrad, no. At Conrad, you okay, buddy? <laughs> Do, do, 
do, do, do, do, do. Looks like Atreides expanding a fair bit down there. Smugglers have grabbed the mid and have a gigantic sniper only army. Um, what's my armory slot? It is locked behind Stalwart Alliance. Okay, so we're getting that. Conrad has reconnected. Conrad has reconnected. All right. Meets back on the menu, boys. A lot of disconnects this game. Only me. Okay, let's uh, let's grab the troops. Let's stealth everybody. We'll use Chani's ability to make everyone do 100% more damage. And we will walk in on top of the rail guns back thereabouts. Just spread out, get some fighting, wreck the range stuff first, and that's basically all of the DPS that Vernius has. I should have dropped my scav team earlier, I didn't even think about it. Trying to ma micromanage them, he's not doing it very well. Let's focus fight here a little bit. The lands are at guards to do slow things down a tad. We did take, we took some losses. We lost a bunch of warriors. They managed to put up a better fight than I expected them to. this? Sure. Ready for instruction. Why not? Why wouldn't we? Why wouldn't we? Let's Listening. annex everything we can get our grubby Thank little service. Fremen fingers on. We are keeping a close eye on those smugglers as fast as I can. who are causing trouble over there. How's our base looking? Our base is good. I think we'll avoid the sun. we... Did this guy die? Yes. He he ran railgun drones across the desert to kill another of my harvesters. This guy is, is outrageous. No wonder I'm trying to murder him. If he tries to go for this one down here, which it sort of looks like he's going to, we will be able to intercept him and properly murder him. Listening. But Koof, my man, if you didn't yes. want to be aggroed by the Fremen, why are you doing all of the 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 Fremen aggroing on the Fremen. <laughs> you started the war, buddy. We're peaceful here. And losing rail drone, rail drone, railgun drone stinks. Those are like 500 solari a piece for you. Keep walking our guys out and about. We need more ones because we'll just take this middle spot too. No matter how much you eat, you wake up fasting. There is troublesome smugglers over there. I don't like them. What are the Fremen doing? Ready for instruction. Their usual fr no, not the Fremen. The Atreides. Fremen are of course doing their usual Fremen things because I'm the Fremen. Do we just keep up a, an aggressive tempo I'm, at, I'm not at a ton I think we want idli a la crab then valuable trinkets and then from there we we commit get rid of some of this junk in here oh we just got some nice water gg atreides says koof koof, koof is a, a, a bit of a bit of a salty dog like the old dog head himself. Free game for you, says Koof. I don't know why you think it's a free game for Atreides. That's an interesting thought. I mean, I believe that Vernius is having a bad time. That makes sense, because you declared war on uh, the Fremen. 
And the Fremen uh, took that personally. Oh my gosh, I've got so much uh, Plasgreed around, i got to get get to using it. Boom. Buffs over there and over we there and over freedom. there. Listening. We trust you, Liet. Let's hide we tracks and we'll come up this behind him. With Shai Halud's he is prepping for war. You but we are all you. are we all stealthed? We're not all stealthed. Thought we would be. Did he see me coming this way? Oh, he Liet. might have, because he's got a thopter right we there. Trust you, Liet. With Shai Halud's favor. Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. I'll hide beneath my cloak and become a little dune. Little me dog Chris knives. Boom, boom, boom. We will just keep fighting. Yeah, I mean, if you are, hunt down my harvesters every chance you get, I'm gonna come fight you. That's those are the rules. Them's the rules, my man. Also, you're Vernius, so you can't afford to have people fight you. Imperial propaganda, gear regs. Hard to see gear regs not going on me. We could just try to grab the propaganda. But Atreides isn't even fighting me, so they wouldn't care. They're going to grab the propaganda for themselves, right? Right? Yeah, we'll, we'll save it. I don't think we can, we can contest. <clears throat> Koof wants gear regs on the Fremen. Oh, we could have taken it. No one tried it. Gear regs on me, courtesy of all players. Surprising absolutely no one. A bit of the bit of the old lag here. Maybe some and my game is my game freezing. I think my game is frozen. That's no good. That's no good. That's not good. I'm totally frozen and I'm crashed. And we're crashed. Let's try and launch it up again. Hope for the best. Boy, what a day. What a day. Not sure how entertaining this recording is going to be. <laughs> it's just riddled with disconnects and crashes. But we are loaded back in, though. We might have that going for us. Not an ideal time to be disconnected, really. Okay. Ready. <laughs> yeah, servers are. Who knows what the servers are doing? We trust you, Liet. Lead us to freedom, Liet. With Shai Halud's favor, we'll send them to their shade. I'll hide beneath my cloak and become a little dude. We'll avoid the sun. We've got a poison reserves on us, so the, the smugglers are tossing in some stuff to help out. We trust you, Liet. We're going. Liet, we'll move fast. Oh, oh, we'll stop, 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 stop. Get that siege back on pretty please. Liet, what does Liet command? Yes. Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. We'll All right, everyone just chill out for a minute here. Ooh, we got we got enough for the altar. We love that. Chani chopped that that engineer up. Do I even want this? No, I don't. We'll liberate it. We got other other stuff, to, other fish to fry. What was that? Did Chani just get eaten by a worm? Apparently, apparently everyone just got eaten by a worm. What the f? I clicked on the village. Hmm. We trust you, Liet. A nice spot for an ambush. Arrakis belongs to 
And there's still worms about. Oh my goodness, we gotta back off just because we don't get we don't want to get worm eaten. Where's the nearest siege over here? Not why is the siege not my friend? Rally next to this siege and then make men as quickly as you can. Annoying. Gain an agent with the ghost trait if I pillage Quartek. What's the Quartek? Is that what I'm fighting on? No. We got smugglers stabbing us in the back over here. And we are light on the manpower. You hate to see it. Oh, that worm strike wrecked me. I don't even particularly care about the Vernius. I just really want, uh, really want my, my field over here back before they annex it. Trouble is, as soon as I walk away, getting attacked here again for sure. To thumper back home. Everyone hop on the worm. Get the blimp moving. We'll make it invisible. And uh, all ally units in long range gain stealth. Okay, so we need ourselves hidden thumpers back up and supplies. There goes Vernius. We will rally, we will ally with these guys, and we will rally there, and we'll make our more of our guys there. We need to get all of our troops out in the sand as quickly as possible. Then we will thumper here to on top of them. They're trying. Oh, they might get it. Annoyingly so. That worm's taking his sweet time. He's taking the longest, the longest route in the history of the world to get where he's going. Oh, that's pretty annoying. Oh my god, look at them wreck my flagship there. That's crazy. Oh my god, it's down already? They killed it in like two seconds. Outrageous. We trust you, Liet. We will help if we can. This fight is not going as well as I thought it might. You will have it. Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. Lead us to freedom. We are listening. We will keep chasing them, because we just need to kill them any way we can. We are getting torn up, though. I can't believe they shot down my, my ship so fast. In like three seconds. Okay, we're in trouble now because we got Vernius pushing us in the east. He is still harassing me. This is going to take, oh my god, since it since we didn't get it done in time, it's going to take us 15 years to, to, to get back. You must tell me. I have a hard time seeing how I, and Vernius is annexing that and that. You know what, we let it go, we let it go. I think it's going to be, mm. it's a hard time seeing how it's not just total war with Vernius, with Vernius attacking me like this. Um, there's no choice but complete aggression. So we gotta we gotta aim to wreck them and destroy their base and then worry about everybody else afterwards. <clears throat> Cause he is just like I don't know. He's all over me. We need this on probably Atreides as much as possible. 
We could get some spires up as like little range units to fly around. Look at that, man. He has been quick on the counterattack. I'll give him that. And we are... It's on us, thanks to Atreides. Hmm. Troublesome. Let's make sure we're not running out of supplies. But, uh, yeah, I don't have any choice but to... No choice but to blood feud... Um... Vernius. Atreides and... Smugs are on your own. We're here. He who beat you in digging, beat him in pruning. We trust you, Liet. Let's get the thumpers. Prepare the thumpers. And we thumper back up to our worm nest. And we rally over here. We make some guys. We don't need so much plascrete though. All by myself. Lead. Lead us to freedom. Our Chris knives are unsheathed. Okay, what does uh, defense breaches look like? We're pretty close to it, actually. Listening. Always stay alert. Lead. Supplies is a problem, though. Ooh, we should have had supplies ready. Just Chani, run. Everybody else can fight. He's, he's focusing and firing on Chani. It's, it's rude. Oh my god, I did not expect, like, full-on war with Vernius of all people. We need to ad adjust and up our manpower. If we have a, something in the region, I think we need hidden thumpers ready. Belongs to the yeah, that guy got Chris in knives. the wrong spot and got murdered for it. Let's look at other sieges since we're sort of at our limit already. Oh yeah, we need to be building. We need to be building. We've been so um, we've been so off kilter thanks to everything getting all messed up. We're gonna break this out at our main base. Swap him for a double red. And just work on rebuilding the army. Listening. Take some territory since we've got so much authority. Use some of that authority to get Chani back. Why can't I get Chani back? Yeah, I don't know. Did I just, I just went a little a little too aggro? Oh, money for Chani. We should be stockpiling them with a rate that bad. Did I go a little too aggro? I mean. I, not really. I think everything I did was pretty justified. I just haven't, I just haven't expected, like, the full Battle Vernius. <laughs> the Battle Vernius caught me off guard for sure. See if we can make any other good buildings and such around. Uh, we just spent all our money, really, which is why we can't. Smugglers at plus 68. It's an easy smuggler win, yeah. Can't really contest him. I don't have any choice but to keep fighting Vernius in the short term here. I mean, I do have a choice, but. What does Liet command? Liet? Did we just get more guys eaten? I feel like we've got so, so few men. We what is happening here? We gotta just. Get some annexing out and about. 
He is still coming to attack and then my harvesters. We need uh, probably a missile turret to try to defend this one. Yeah, I mean, this is some just some absurd aggro from him. What can you do though? What can you do against such reckless hate? What does Liet command? We can get a blue thing down here. Oh, we can't get anything because we don't got any money. What does Liet command? We'll send them to their shade. We got a ton of agents though. He's apparently thumpering me while I try and attack these guys. Uh, yeah, that's pretty annoying. That's pretty annoying, the old run across the desert with thumpers. Run across the desert with drones and then thumper when, the, when they come to, to stop you. So we need some infiltrators to counter that, really. Yes, troublesome. Troublesome for sure. We did at least chase away those drones, and we could take this shield wall spot, which would be good for us. Yeah. He's been more trouble. He's been more trouble than he's worth, for sure. And of course, the horrible smugglers, like, what can you do? Takes three months to siege them down. I was trying to save us from them, but I caught the Vernius early aggro. Hmm, so what looks good here? We are using up our authority, so we're not going to waste it yet. Water cellars, command stuff. No, we don't care about any of that. None of that matters to me at all. We will just uh, keep on our, expanding, our expansionist tendencies here. Remaking our troops. There's a Chani we can remake. We could probably... The Chome Raid is not very good, but we need a little bit more money than we got currently. He's working in airstrips and missiles. Are we starting to lose supplies this time? No, we're not. It's weird that those guys never lose supplies anymore. It's very weird. Infiltrators need to scramble. Mechanical units is what we want. Let's see if we can jump on this harvester drone. Probably not. Harvester drones are pretty tough, actually. Ten armor on them. It's gonna take us all day to do anything about it. But if we don't lose supplies, and since we've got Chani to make us avoid worm sign when we're stealth, we can run up and easily chase his guys around that are causing us grief. Right? We shouldn't be attracting worms. Oh, we don't have Chani. We don't have Chani. She's dead. So we are attracting worms. Oh well. Let's jump on these rail guns anyways. We're here. Swift as the wind. The sound muffles our steps. Just keep them busy. Because we need still need to rebuild a lot, quite a bit really. <laughs> quite a bit. No matter how much you eat, you wake up fasting. But it's like He's just constantly harassing my harvesters, and I don't have any other options. Like, he's like, he's all over me. If I try to fight the smugglers, he just comes and fights me. <clears throat> so we will try to get this spice field away next, I believe, is the plan. We've got our, our stuff built out for the most part. He's sending a folder relay up to attack there. That's that's a thing. Yes. We trust you, Liet. Liet. 
Hmm. We almost have our sky gazing up. Then maybe a siege incentives would be good. I could see some base fights later on in this game. We will push to fight here. We've got our supplies up. We can hide our tracks. We can make another altar. Keep some infiltrators hidden in the back. Fighting smugs. Good. Somebody ought to. Somebody really ought to be. He is attacking up north. That's fine. The sand muffles our steps. We will annex this first and then we can go up and stop him. There's wind coming. Lead us to freedom. This path is dry. We are listening. Doot, doot, doot. They do got a bit of a battle down there. We are light on the thumpers. Do something about that. Oh, no Shai Hulu Temple. We're too poor. Okay. Listening. We're here. He has not even gotten to annex that yet, so we will have plenty of time to do something about it. it is for the best. We're Get that harvesting team before. home safely. We trust you, Leah. Yeah, so we're going to aim to finish freedom. this annex first. And Shia then... Come back, or go back to, to to defend our base. Yeah, troublesome match. Not exactly what we Daughter wanted out of this Chai. game. Daughter of Liat, you must tell me. Liat, where are Rock's claws? We're here, listening. I am Chani. Make sure we got Daughter all of our Liat. buttons pressed properly. We got another jump. blimp up. Let me make sure it stealths everybody. We don't want to detect stealth, we want to stealth everybody. Is it time to move? What do you need? This path is dry. We're going. Lead us to freedom. We're going. Our hope is high. I'll hide beneath my cloak and become a little dude. Okay, we're good here. We shall thumper up. Happy to play ping pong with you. Listening. We have annihilated that army, all good. We will we need to prep hidden thumpers because we're being forced to use a lot of regular thumpering. Okay, we will use our hidden tracks to just run across the desert safely, because Chani gives us, um, Chani gives us defenses against that, or, or rather, she can't, sandworms won't eat Chani, won't eat Chani or Fremen while they're stealthed, so we got that going for us. And yeah, time just to, uh, jump on some baddies. Here we go, jumping on some Vernius. Oh, I hate to be leaving smugglers alone. Cell search is probably a good idea. I think we'd probably like a cell search. Support that. Hmm. I still feel like um, our man, the Vernius, Vernius is not uh, not interested in peace here. If he went, if he offered me a peace deal, I would take it. 
present will surprise you. Is it time to move? We've got the top defended. He's, he went up to try and grab that, but he's not going to be able to. We've got our hidden thumpers up. Let's keep the pressure on. Maybe, we're, maybe we'll be able to kill him and then pivot. Maybe. We're losing some stuff over there, actually, which I don't love. Keeping up on the folder relay, that's good. If we could bring that down, we'd be in good shape. Not bad for a pile of junk. He is pressing up there, but we might win that, actually, because the fight engineers are not very tough. Let's go and stealth our army is the next plan. And we can get another har spice harvester over here abouts. Vernius is terrible. Yeah, Vernius is terrible. So why are you yeah, using him to make our enemies? He just lost that fight up there. He's sending extra help. Do we have a reasonable rally point up there? Not really. Not a reasonable one. We're just being pillaged over there, which I guess we don't mind too much. <clears throat> so we want to save up to 500. We want to keep messing him up. As best we can. Keep making guys. Keep pressuring. Can I annex that? Not really. I do want the annex there, but we've lost all ability to get authority because of that horrible thing that passed. I guess we're not doing that then. We're going to try and liberate if at all possible. He has lost his battle against the militias up top. We got that going for us. Pause by Koof. This guy did get uh, attacked. We could do some craft workshops now, which we really ought to. Game is unpaused by Koof. Let's sell our spice as best we can. We're gonna dump the manpower building since we're good on it at the moment. Craft workshops there. Check out the battles, looking okay. Is it time to move? They'll die without honor. Please. Life is in the service of life. The desert will surprise you. Listen to the sound. Lead us to freedom. Please. This path is dry. We'll avoid the sun. He is rebuilding, but we're gonna give him some grief. Yeah. Yes. Don't start early fights with them. <laughs> Not bad for a pile of junk. Smugglers is gonna be tough to catch. We're at 17k, which is not anywhere near enough. Um, where's our blue base? Here's a blue base. Let's get us a research center up. We gotta get this altar in here to try and st stop the main base from blasting us. We will prep our own defense breaches. Listening. 
I don't want to be eaten by worms. He thumpered us. Can we walk home, maybe? I mean, we've messed with him pretty bad. I think he'll have a hard time rebuilding. So our hope is to rebuild and then maybe base snipe him and then take his land and try to beat the smugs. I think that's the short-term goal. Maybe also the long-term goal. Ay ay ay. Crazy. We trust you, Liet. Is Chani still alive? She is. Alright, good girl. Smuggler Hedge is going to be a, a, an incredibly huge problem to stop, though. We are going to go jump on Avernius main base once we heal up. Do we have any close by sieges? There's sort of the one up north. Oh, that got pillaged. Good, good job on his part. We gotta pillage them sieges. We could get extra influence or intel. We will trade some spice for intel. That's fine. And we are just waiting for the altar to heal up, really, and then we will head back and fight. But we need not the hidden thumpers. We need supplies. Fremen are pretty bad at breaking bases, but um, we kind of we want to get up to maybe more intel. Can we get extra intel anywhere? Yes, yeah, so we can get a little bit over there. More intel will allow us to uh, will allow us to um, follow up our defense breach with a second defense breach. And as long as he doesn't have too many men remade by then, we should be able to really wreck him. I have the council. Landsrad support. Punishers. Give us Landsrad punishers. I, d I doubt we win that, but it would be fun. If, we, if those guys are extra, 200% extra damage against main bases, we get them, that would be perfect with our current plan. Perfect with the current plan. Whew. What a weird game. I'm sort of surprised smugglers haven't won yet. <laughs> Hopefully Atreides has given them trouble. All right, we did get our punishers. We got the Punishers. Time for the punishment. I grab everybody. Make sure Chani's on her own number. And let's make our way back. Make our way back over towards the old S vault here. We could buy some mercenaries to come help out. Are there any other mercenaries around the map? Just make sure we're grabbing our our free intel if we, wherever we find it. You guys stay stealthed, please. He does have a bit of a force up. We'll use our hidden thing to try to slow them. Try and tear up their army as best we can. If we could properly tear them up, we will just hop on the base. We'll drop supplies on them. We will prep new supplies. We will defense breaches. All right, it's going pretty well. It's cutting. We're cutting, cutting quite well. We got a good, a good fight on them there. We are getting this up. Pause for one second. Not bad for a 
a pile of junk. There is only one sky, one desert. Great. More sand. On it, boss. Let's break some bones. I'm back. Had, had to feel uh, had to feel the phone call from the wife. I have two eyes. I have two. Ooh. Um, it looks like Koof has surrendered. <laughs> More or less. More or less. It was a tough fight. He was really he was really causing a ruckus out there. For sure. Stop. I want to I want these missiles to stop getting tossed right into the the heart of my army if at all possible here. Got this lands rat punishers firing away. I love it. There we go. What would be good to annex back here? Nothing yet. Koof is gone. GG Koof. That was um, outrageously aggressive uh, House Vernius play. And you know, you like to see him mix it up sometimes, but uh, I was pretty surprised um, because that is actually, <laughs> that's the natural result of outrageously aggressive Vernius play is um, the Fremen just come and kill you. <laughs> no matter how much you All right, let's try and focus on what the heck is going on in my empire back here. What the heck is going on? We do still have a defense breach up, and the smugglers are very, very taut. So we will try and take the middle from them is the next plan. So we need to heal up. And get into the middle. Listening. All right, everybody to the middle. Pretty please. Are we not stealthed at home yet? No, we didn't get Desert Watchers. Oh, we should have been on Desert Watchers for sure. I have two eyes. I have two feet. The sand is our path. What is it I may do? We'll claim their water. Okay, we are up here ready to fight some smugglers. We need supplies up. Listening. Let's make peace with the Atreides. Peace with the Atreides, we need to fight the smugglers, don't we? The Atreides have accepted peace. Marvelous. The traders are making 32 a day, smugglers are making 49. I am making a meager 19. Listening. But I can do a bit of I could do a bit of racing. I could do a bit of race car. I think I um hmm. Is there an airfield here? Let's wreck some of that airfieldy kind of stuff. Gonna take me three months to annex this. Smugglers might just need to be base killed at this point. What do you think, trades? Might just need to be. I'm down. <laughs> Got a defense breach with his name on it. <laughs> hmm. So, if we, we knocked out the airfield, so we can't really get there. Um, loss of rights. I'd love to have it. Oh, but we do want money too. Chome shares. Who's got Chome shares right now? Smuggler bounty on House Atreides. Oh well, I agree with that. As much as I'd like loss of rights, it could just it just won't happen. So we'll get a, get a little extra money thanks to the bounty. We're gonna lose our punishers, but they did well. They blew up one base for us. We are starting to get our authority back. Did we ever rebuild our yellow thing? We didn't. Let's get our administrative hall up back thereabouts. Looks like he is attacking down south. 
Good, good. Maybe I will um, re-up the boys and then uh, go just keep pushing on them from the north. Or right onto his base or something like that. Altar number three is up, ready to go. <laughs> you know, everyone gets three flagships, right? The first two are for practice. It does look like he is coming to fight in the for the middle. This path is dry. Yes, We're gonna stealth everybody. Johnny, go! Just jump on him with everything we got. I feel like that's going pretty okay. Nope, the evac. Can we get his hero before he gets away? Yes, we didn't evac everything. We did catch the hero. We could try to catch the wraith. We did just keep people on the on the siege. Keep people on the siege. We gotta get back and heal, actually. You should be jumping on this wraith, man. Go get that wraith. Okay, he is. He is. Coming to wipe him mid. I already wiped him. I just need you to get that wraith. We gotta heal up. We lost some folks. What do we lose? Skirmishers and stuff. Maybe we'll no can't. This is the current bug in the hot fixes. You can't cancel guys once you start making them. <laughs> Not bad for a pile of junk. The land will move below us. Boy, he's getting real close. <clears throat> he's getting real close. You hate to see it. Where's the nearest? That one's already been pillaged. That one's everyone's been been. Hard at work pillaging the sieges around them. Smart boys. Let's um, let's prep some some tracks. I will worm in on him if you draw him to a fight. Manpower guild flavor. He is flying north to fight there. Can we prep? A worm this jump on him here, maybe? Oh, he's gonna get out of there. He's gonna move away. He's not entirely moved away, he's kinda moving away. Okay. Where's my ship? Let's get everyone together. Let's get stealth up under the old ship. Taking mid will be helpful. And then we're gonna base jump him. I think we go for, I think we go for base kill. Got in middle. It's very good. He's down south. Wonderful. Every journey leads us to the desert. I'm the just south. Us. He says. Every journey leads us to the desert. Every journey leads us to the I will desert. just go attack this base up here. Drop supplies up here, prep new supplies. He draws him back up because he doesn't want to lose stuff. We trust you, Liet. We have no fear. This path is dry. I am Chani, daughter of Liet. Get on him, boys. Listening. They won't see us before it's too late. This path is dry. Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. They'll meet our Chris knives. Shyalud willing. They'll meet our Chris knives. 
Johnny died. He must have got her with snipers. It's okay. I'm happy to lose everybody. To keep them busy. Fremen are coming back in. Or the... Our buddies, the Atreides, are coming in for the base attack. Let's move this guy out of the range of that turret over there. We don't need that shooting at us. We get a little extra manpower. Hit him with the... Uh... Oh, he's choming too. What a guy. What a guy. We might, we might lose another altar, but the next altar is almost ready, so we'll be fine. I think we'll turn that into an annex there. Do we have things that can... What can I annex? Nothing. I can't really annex anything. So I'm just coming down to try and help with the base. My flagship's down. We got new troops coming. We are prepping. We still gotta hit the base. Yeah, we gotta base kill him for sure. He's at 46%. He's choming up. What a boss. I mean, I knew the smugglers were gonna be big trouble. I knew they were gonna be big trouble there. Um, uh, if I had authority, I would love to apply it to a rebellion here, but I don't think it's any good. We're just going to run some more troops into the base as quickly as we can. Hopefully the Atreides force is chonky enough. Can I rally point over here maybe? Hopefully it's a chunky enough Atreides force that he can get stuff done in there. We will just keep running. Defense breaches is on it. Oh, he's got a big chunk of Lanzarote guards. That's going to ruin this plan. It's gonna ruin this plan. Oh yeah, yeah, that's gonna be tough. We need more intel. We need more intel, bad. We're not being assassinated. We just need guys on intel. Yikes! Yikes! Time to back off. Time to back off. Looks like trouble. We trust you, Liet. Shyalud willing. We'll avoid the sun. Looks like trouble to me. I don't like it. Not get eaten by worms, everybody. Hmm. So he's not gonna hedge win, but he may chome win. We should be buying chome. Turn the on, turn on the auto buy. Not that we've got a lot of money to work with, but we did take this from him, so we pushed him down a little bit. We gotta worry about. I mean, the treaties are also right within. Um, right within the. He's expanding over there. He is going for his own hedge win. Yikes. <clears throat> he is still buying stuff, so we gotta try and do something about this economy of his. We got, what do we got here? We can get more of this stuff up. We gotta get more guys. He, we can't allow him to be pillaging things. No pillaging for you. It's illegal. We may get killed again here because there's an awful lot of snipers around. Let's pillage this ourselves to at least keep him from pillaging it. It's something. 
Atreides are just booming their own hedge, but I don't have enough authority to do so. Listening. We trust you, Liet. Chome. We'll Chome. We... We're going. You gotta go. Again, Atreides. Or it's Chome. Arrakis belongs to the Fremen. Defense breaches. And supplies. He's down to 46%, so Trees must have bought some up or some shares just got released. What's Chome? <clears throat> come on, Trades, please help. Don't just do hedge. Please come help. Here's the uh, refinery, this is what we need. No, nope, we don't actually want to fight. Ooh, we are getting slowed. We weren't prepared. Yikes. That was bad. Bad engagement. I thought he would be uh, cautious to jump in, but he was not. Trades! Don't try and boom. Please help. I am still too far out. I'm at 24. Lead us to freedom. This path is dry. We'll avoid the sun. You gotta help, Atreides. Come on, man. You peaceful annexing your own stuff, probably. Lead. With Shai Hulud's favor. You can't have that other special region. Sandworms can't reach the area. What can they reach? You, what good are you? We are listening. What good are you, sandworms? Let's take this special region and make sure it's not peacefully annexed. Oh, we gotta hope that the bad chome thing happens to smugglers again, or we could increase the chome rates on the next lands ride in a couple days. And then I gotta take ter terrain from the Atreides. Probably over in the east there, it looks like. We did get that hedge off of the smugglers. He is we still choming. We gotta spend all of our money on the chomes. And we gotta keep marching to the east. Boy, our water's terrible though is our problem. 49%, I think we're in trouble. I think we're in big trouble. And we missed our spice tax, so we're not going to win the game, I'll tell you that much. It's not ideal. We did get that annex. We just need a minute to try and hopefully stop the Atreides over here. We can't annex it though, it's too much. All we can do is stop them and give the game to the smugs. <coughs> oh, GG. GG GG smugs? Question mark? Hmm. I would have loved Oh! Sale incentive to make it hundred percent more expensive to buy. <laughs> Shiver me timbers. Might save us a little bit of time. We will support that, or we gotta assume that Atreides is supporting that. And then we put it on his main base, maybe? We gotta assume that Atreides will stop that. If we make his main base weaker, we might be able to die of him. Okay. We, trust you, Liet. we will betray the Atreides. Lead us to freedom. We have no fear. I'll hide beneath my cloak and become a little dune. Arrakis is our home. Hopefully we can get this airfield before he flies. We did. Good. Hopefully we can kill some 
militia before we all die. We might not. We might not. The militia might win this fight thanks to supplies. That's pretty catastrophic for us. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. We lost that fight to supplies. I guess it's an Atreides win. Nope. Smugglers got it with Chome. Ay. Well, that was a weird game. Vernius had it out for us, which really, really set us back. We could hardly even do what we wanted to do until month six or seven when we were able to finally take Vernius out. But, uh, yeah, those smugglers are nasty, though. They get that fast, um, they get that fast count on um, hedge buildings. You know, the, the meta is to grab special regions, um, build your craft workshops in them super fast, which starts you that ticking clock of daily hedge gain. And if you let that go for too long, and it's hard to stop too because because they take only the special regions and they've got the counselor that makes the sieges on them take one or two hundred percent longer. It's really hard to take those regions from them and it kind of disincentivizes even attacking them. Let's take a look here. We were at 26, which is, you know, we already had our research center built, so we didn't have any boom in us. We didn't have any authority. We were, we were out of it. The best we could do was try to slow people down there, and it wasn't slow enough. We needed Atreides to commit to killing the smugglers, and then they could have, uh, they could have outboomed us on hedge, probably. But they seemed like they were sitting in the back seat trying to peacefully annex their way to victory. Um... Yeah, 50% on the smugglers, 16 on them, only 3% on me because I was very poor. Developments, Vernius, then smugglers, then Atreides, then me. Uh, that was weird. I, we had, I think it was really the water regions around our base was so, so bad. It's like, what can you do? Um, it was real tough because we did, it, it deprives us of intel, it deprives us of water to be spreading out and about. We, I mean, we, we lost that last fight against the militia because we just didn't have, didn't have enough water. Uh, so Lari production, Vernius was making good money. No wonder they could afford a big army. That's weird. They were making a lot of money there. But then the smugglers eventually took off. Um, Atreides had a lot. Atreides had a huge bank. They were, they were too slow. They should have been spending, look, they had way more money than the smugs like the entire game. Smugglers, I guess, had slightly more income, but uh, they were Atreides was banking it, and meanwhile the smugs were uh, investing it, and so by the time they started buying, it was probably already pretty expensive, and we just weren't able to stop the smugs from pushing it over the limit. It's real tough to take money away from the smugs too, because they make so much of their income from underworld headquarters and other people's bases. Right? It's tough. It's tricky. That's why you got to fight them early and fight them often, like I was trying to do, but uh, we had that Vernius guy giving us the business. Um, lands are at standing. Atreides a little bit, but really not that much. Um, nobody was pushing too much politics. We were the intel gods, and a lot of that is thanks to Mother Ramalo, who is just amazing. Plus three intel per, per harvester out on the map doing work. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Military. Um, <laughs> we were forced into a relatively early military. Look, the Vernius even had a really a super tiny military the whole time, and this is the whole time. All these these months two through four, they're sneaking in, they're killing our spice teams, they're killing our spice teams, doing all kinds of troublesome stuff, and then I just build up to 65 CP and start giving them trouble. But then the smugglers came and gave me trouble back, and then Vernius rebuilt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a rough game. It didn't certainly didn't go the way I wanted it to. Poor Chani died at least three times. We did kill the we did kill the the Vernius, which was fun. I always enjoy killing someone. Everyone likes a base kill. Just tough to tough to catch up after that. The Fremen really, while they're super strong militarily, they don't have that uh, they don't have that late game push to get stuff right. They don't have anything that really gives them an extra good hedge bump. They have you know they don't make the money to contest Chome and stuff. They don't. They're fun to play. They're great fighters, but they they struggle taking down a win condition. I think that's that's my uh, that's my take on the Fremen. But it's a fun game nonetheless. Thanks everybody for playing. Thanks everybody for watching, and I will see you guys around next time. Take care.